Hello everyone, and welcome back for more Mario Party DS. Last time what we did was we uh, wrapped up the minigame mode where we played the, uh, the this game's decathlon. I won that barely. And then the Rocket Rascals where we both lost. I just could not win any minigames to save my life for some reason. And including the freaking study fall one where my A button decided to not work. Was not happy about that. <coughs> mm, excuse me. Yes, I did. I scared the babies. Um. So we're gonna do. Some puzzles. So there's five puzzles. We have Mario's Puzzle Putty, Puzzle Party, Puzzle Putty, Jesus. I don't know where the hell I got that word from. Mario's Puzzle Party, Babom Breakers, your favorite minigame from Mario Party 5, Peace Out. Uh, block star and stick and spin. So we're gonna uh, start out with the Mario's Puzzle Party. Connect two or more of a similar block type to clear them. Whoever reaches 100 points first wins. The next box will fall. It's displayed on the to right of the screen. Uh, stack the blocks strategically. So, I think we have pretty much a pretty clear winner here. It's not gonna be me, because I'm not good at these puzzle games. Oh, you can see both of our screens. That's weird. Um. Oh, crap, I am... Whoops! Oh, shit. Um... Blowing his hands. <laughs> yeah, I saw that coming from a mile away. I filled up my screen. Oh, you did? Yes, I did. Saw that coming from a mile away. Um, so next one is the Babam Breakers. Connect three or more of a similar block type to clear them. Whoever reaches 100 points first wins. So move, spin right, spin left, flip. You could also drop blocks in your rival's area. If you destroy blocks there, you'll score those points, not your opponent. Use this tactic to boost your score. Seems simple enough for me to lose. Oh, kaboom! Jesus, that is a loud explosion.
Oh my god, I actually won a puzzle game! No way, I won a puzzle game! Now, time to play Caitlyn's minigame. Peace out. As they only played this game like probably ten times in the story mode in that game. Grab the pieces on the conveyor belt that help you fully fill your field. Put any that you don't want in the trash. The player with the most points wins. So move, pick up, put down, spin left or spin right. Line up pieces of the same color to score more points. And be sure to toss pieces you don't need in the trash instead of trying to use them. What does this look like the most points or the first to 100? You ready for your PT? You had to mentally prepare yourself to play this game for the 30th time? Let's do five minutes. Oh, yep. We're gonna suffer. Ah! Wait, how do I select it? A. Oh, I was pressing A and it wasn't working. Damn it! You keep stealing the pieces I want! Oh damn it, I don't want this piece. Well, this is not going well for me. You didn't need that piece, so you stole it from me? Damn it. One thing I can tell you is this is not going well for me. Oh shit, well... pieces
It's stubborn. And when it wants to grab. Holy crap, I kicked ass! Okay. Over what I got. <laughs> yeah, you played this game significantly more than I have, which I find really funny. Like, this was like your, the minigame you played the most in Mario Party 5. Yeah, I actually did better this time. You did better this time. Oh, I remember this from Mario Party 6. Connect five or more blocks of the same color to clear them. The gauge will fall when the blocks rise to the gate. The player whose gauge hits zero loses. Oh, I lost this big time in Mario Party 6. I remember that. Clear a block with an arrow to cause problems for your opponent. And some piece of stack. Okay. Oh, I was like, shit, I thought for sure I was gonna lose that. Holy shit. I'm not gonna lie, I don't fully understand this one. Uh, I don't think I did either. I was like, just trying to move the blocks, and I'm like, okay, I do this. Oh, I see now. They all move to the top. And last but not least, stick and spin. You definitely kicked my ass at this last time in Mario Party 7. So rotate the cylinder to clear balls by connecting five or more of the same color. You'll lose if ten more balls stick out past the outer blue ring, which I had that happen to me in Mario Party 7. You clear a lot of balls, you can cause trouble for your opponent. So spin ball and drop heat. Whoa, 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 holy shit. Shit.
No, it appears not. Holy shit. Somehow I did better this time. So that that's exactly what happened to me last time. Alright, well, uh, I guess we'll move on to Triangle Twisters now. Twist! Triangle clusters to connect four or more triangles of the same color, which will clear them from the field. The player with the most points wins. You can make not only chains, but also triangles and hexagons. So watch for every opportunity to connect tiny triangles of the same color. Okay, so stylus, choose, spin, scroll. Or the D-pad, you can choose, spin, or scroll. Okay. Not sure if I fully understand it, but... Oh, I see. What is what is that noise? Oh, I figured I, I got one. Okay, this is fucking confusing. I'm just kind of doing random things at this point. Hope something works. Uh, yeah, um, wow. You got double of what I got. Wait, no. No, you didn't get double. What the hell? What math am I doing? Holy shit. There's 180 and 180 is 360, not 260. Absolutely the fuck not. I'm done with this puzzle bullshit. And that'll be it for this stream. Next time, what we'll be doing is puzzle mode. See you guys later. Er, not puzzle mode. Extras mode. Jesus Christ. See you guys later.